If you've finished your PowerPoint show and you've added in the transitions, then you're ready to add in music. First, you have to decide what music you want to have, and you need to make sure that you have it in one of three formats, MP3, WAV, WMA. Once you have it in one of those three formats, you can put it in your slideshow. Click Insert, Sound, from file, navigate to the folder where you uh, saved the music. When this window comes up, click automatically, and then the music tools should come up. If it doesn't come up, which seems like mine didn't, you can click on format. No. If it doesn't come up, which mine didn't. Double click on the picture of um, sound file that comes up. And I'm going to move it over here. Double click and that brings up the sound tools. Starting over here you want to click hide during show, click loop until stopped, play across slides, and then save it. As with transitions, you need to see how it sounds or how it looks together. So play it. And that's how to add in your music. Now that your show is ready, it's time to add transitions. Click on the Animations tab. and you can choose which kind of transition you'd like to have. If you click on this arrow, it gives you all kinds of options and then if you just hover your mouse over an option, it'll show you a preview of what that kind of transition looks like. Open the options, then try them. White, fade and dissolve, etc. See which one you like the best. You can try all the different ones. Right. Once you've chosen one, click on that one. Then, over here where it talks about advancing the slide, click off on mouse click, click on automatically after, and then decide how long you want each slide to be on. Think about how long it takes you to read what's on the slide and base your timing on that. Three seconds, four, five. Not too long because you don't want your show to be slow and boring, but not too short because you do want people to be able to take in the information before the slide advances to the next. As a final step, Click Apply to All, and that way every slide will transition the same way. This is important for consistency, even though it would be fun to have each slide transition in a different way, it becomes distracting and it really does take away from your show. So pick one that you like the best and then Apply to All.